So here's your voice. This is my new lead dioxide electrode using an iron substrate by using an epoxy undercoat. And I'm running at 12 volts right now and at 1.15 amps. I'm running 12 volts just for analytical purposes. It's to test two things, the durability of the electrode and the feasibility of uh, perchlorate production on the electrode. So I'm using potassium chlorate as the feed because that will be a telltale sign whether or not any perchlorate will be produced after a few hours by the uh, pre immediate precipitation of uh, perchlorate on the uh, anode. I'm also going to use these electrodes for ozone generation and overall the reason for me making these electrodes is because not everyone can run something like 28 amps through a fucking cell or even 36 or 32 or whatever so this will offer people who only want to run like maybe 4 or 5 amps or make just slightly larger electrodes which is more manageable for lab scale setups.